Hello my lovelies and welcome to a new video. Today I have a home bargains haul for you. So if you would like to see the bits that I picked up from home bargains this November stroke December, then stay tuned. Welcome to a new video. Today I've got a sit down video. Thank God for that. Honestly, I have killed myself with these come shop with me's that I've actually hit a bit of a, a, a brick wall. Like my legs are not working for me at the moment. So I'm happy to be sitting and doing a video um, and just doing a little haul. So um, if you guys had watched my last home bargains come shop with me, I honestly, I went in because I needed a new toaster and I just wanted to go and see what Home Bargains has on offer for us this November stroke December and I was so pleasantly surprised, like there was so much goodness. So if you would have seen that, uh, come shop with me, this is the following video, just to follow up, show you what I picked up from Home Bargains. There's so much for you in terms of gifts to give people for Christmas and the prices are so amazing. So if you're sort of stuck to for what to get people, have a look in Home Bargains. Luckily, I went to a Home Bargains that was quite big and there was a lot in there. Um, it's not my usual home bargains that I go to and actually I don't really go to home bargains because there's not one that's like really close to me the closest one to me is in Lakeside and actually it's not that big um so when I went to this um one in Chelmsford I was like oh my god it is really big compared to the one that I normally go to so there was so much more goodies to sort of see and have and also want to shout out a lovely lady called Deb Debbie or Deborah, I think her name was, and she uh, approached me in Home Bargains at the Tills and was like, are you Jodie? And I said, yes. And she was like, I follow you on YouTube. Um, so it was really lovely to meet you. And also this week, so crazy, um, every time I've gone out, somebody's noticed me from YouTube. So I'm just like, pff, my mind is blown. Like I'm like, oh my God. Um, so it's really nice to meet all of you that I've met this week. Um, I can't remember all of your names, but it's really, really been, it's been, it's been crazy. Like I can't believe people are noticing me from my YouTube. So yeah, thank you so, so much for coming over and having a chat with me. I love speaking to you all. And it's so nice to actually meet you all in person, especially you know, you guys are so amazing. You watch my channel and you watch me every week and you always leave so many comments and it's so nice to get to know you online, but to meet you in person is even more special. So thank you for coming and saying hello. And if you ever do see me, don't be shy, come and say hello. Cause one of the ladies that I see um, this weekend, she said that she'd see me once before, but she was too shy to come and say hello. So I'm so happy that you did come and say hello. I just realized I haven't even introduce myself. If you are new, hello and welcome to my channel. My name's Jodie and I do everything to do with plus size fashion over here, but it's not just about plus size fashion, it's about fashion in general, but I do want to inspire the plus size woman to step out of her comfort zone, try new colours, try new styles and just love yourself that little bit more. Just find some inner confidence and just really love life as you are, because we only get one life. So I, yeah, want to inspire you to just feel more confident and comfortable in your skin, to express yourself through beautiful fashion that is really available now for us. Like there was times where we didn't have the availability to such great fashion. And I am just so grateful that we have it now. And I'm so grateful that I get to inspire you and show you what's out there for the plus size body and show you what it truly looks like on a real plus size woman. So that's what I do over here. I'm also a mum and I do a little bit of lifestyle vlogging. I do sort of homeware, um, lifestyle vlogs and all of that jazz. Um, so yeah, and I also do a bit of skincare, hair care and makeup. I love body care, self care. I think it's just so important to just 
spend that time with yourself and look after yourself. I have chronic illness, so I have a lot of symptoms that I suffer with daily, body pains and brain fog and just the list just goes on. And so I found an inner peace with myself where I'm like, okay, I'm gonna live like, I've, I've got to live like this, I have no choice, but what can I do to make myself feel better? And for me is the love of plus size fashion, getting dressed um, when I can and making myself feel good and look good. And also just looking after my, my skin, my hair, my nails, and just doing self care. It really, it really does something for my soul. So I really love beauty and there is a little bit of absolutely everything on this channel. So if that sounds like a channel you would like to watch and be part of, I would absolutely love it if you would be part of my YouTube family. And all you need to do is pause this video and just press the subscribe button just below the video if you are watching it on your phone. If you are watching it on your TV, then you just need to click up onto my little, there's a little icon with my face on it. Um, if you tap on that, it will ask you if you wanna subscribe. Just press that subscribe button and I would absolutely be so honored to have you part of my YouTube family. And don't forget there's a notification button. If you tap on that notification button, it will just notify you when I've uploaded a new video. I do try and upload every Wednesday and Sunday but like I said I do suffer with chronic illness so I don't really have set times that I put the videos up and sometimes I may miss a video just because obviously if it's a, a real high pain week or I'm really feeling under the weather then it just makes that it just makes me a bit delayed on my videos but mainly for a quite a while, I've been able to stick to a Wednesday and a Sunday. And um, yeah, if you tap on the notification button, it will just notify you when I have uploaded that video. And at the end of this video, if you do enjoy it, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I really do appreciate all the thumbs up and the comments down below. If you comment, I love to get to know you. And also it just helps me know that you guys are enjoying this content so I can create more of it. Just also wanna say to everybody who has subscribed to my channel, thank you so, so much because honestly, I see the numbers going up up and it just blows my mind so thank you so much for being part of this beautiful little community that we have here we're all uplifting each other and it's just nice from one woman to another to you know spread love and be kind to each other so that's what we have over here so thank you so so much so let's get into this haul and let me show you what I picked up from Home Bargains. Honestly, I've been wanting to do this video, but I've just not felt well. And today it's quite bright. So thank God I can do some filming without worrying about the lighting being bad. And um, yeah, I can show you what I've got here. And so I can start using everything. So I'm just going to literally dig into the bag and just pick things out and show you. And if I can't remember the price i'll pop it on the screen um for you home bargains does have ha does have an online at um online website which i actually didn't know i've never actually ordered anything from home bargains before um i don't know if they have an app but it is worth like looking on their website because honestly their prices are amazing but it is great if you can get into store go into store i i I'm lucky that my mobility, I'm still able to go to a store, but I can't do like the whole store if it's really big. Um, and so I didn't get to do the whole of home bargains. Um, I got to do maybe like three quarters or just over half of it. But what I did do, I am happy for what I see. And also, had I looked around all of it, I probably would have spent more money. So I, I'm happy with what I got. And um, I definitely will be taking another trip uh, sort of in the next week or so to pick up some more bits. So yeah, let's get into this video. Okay, so we're going to start off with something that's a bit of like a novelty, kind of funny kind of joke. Um, so from, I don't know, from when I can remember just years, I've always picked up a link set for my boys for Christmas. It's so funny because my mum always used to get them for my brother and then I've always got them from my sons and they're always like, I know what this is. Um, and so I'm just following the, tra tra the tradition on and I'm just still doing it every year. So I picked up this 
little set here and I really like the um, the kind of box. It's really sort of kind of funky and out there, like the colours, like graffiti looking. And in this one, you get... Um, you get a, sh a shower gel and then two sprays. So I picked up this one. I think they were about two or three pounds, but I'll put the price either on the screen or I will put the um, products in the description box below. Um, and then this is the next one that I bought, which is the, <clears throat> excuse me, the Lynx Africa. And this one also comes with two sprays and um, a shower gel. So these are kind of like little stocking fillers that, um, yeah, I do it every year. It's so funny. They, they absolutely know what it is. So next up, I picked up this little set here and you would have seen it in the Come Shop With Me. Honestly, I couldn't leave it. I just feel like it is just so pretty. These are actual like glass. Are they glass? No, they actually are plastic. They look like they're glass, but they're plastic. And you've got the um, hand wash cream here. And then you've got the lotion. And it's sitting on like a ceramic tray here with the uh, gold sort of um, detailing at the top. And so I really like the look of these. Um, the scent is coffee, whiskey, and vanilla cream scent. Um, and I picked it up. I, I weren't too sure who I'm going to give this to. I feel like I might just give it to like my sister-in-law for Christmas, but I just couldn't leave it. I just thought it was so nice. And it was like three pounds, like three pound odd. And I just, yeah, I really, really liked it. So that was the next thing that I picked up. And then in that same section, they had um, some more sort of uh, skincare, body care stuff. And I see this little set here, which is a little hand care, um, hand and nail set. And inside you've got the hand lotion, nail oil, nail clippers and a nail file. Um, so I really like this. I'm not sure if I'm going to give it as a gift or if I'm going to keep it myself. But I do love um, to keep like a hand, hand cream in my bag. And I do like putting cuticle oil on sort of every now and then through the week. Um, and like it comes with the little clippers and the little nail file. So I thought it was a nice little gift or like I said, I might keep it for myself. Um, it was like £2.49. So really, really good price. And the packaging's really pretty as well. So great for gifting. Next up from Home Bargains, I picked up these vapor shower tablets. I There was only one box left on the um, shelf and I just really like the look of them. I thought that they'd be great. It's the time of the year when everyone comes down with flus or feels a bit stuck and I thought I'd give these a try. I have used like uh, ones that have like a really nice smell um, but I've never used any sort of like menthol um, infused ones uh, and yeah I thought it'd be, be great for especially this time of year. So I think they were about less than two pounds um, and you get a pack of three in there so not bad. Um, yeah, I wish there was more than three in there, actually. I didn't realise there was only three in there, but um, still very useful. So, so next, I picked up some Miracle Hydration. That's what it's called. Mir Miracle Hydration Hair Oil made with 100% natural coconut oil. And I picked this up because it's got a little spray on the top. Now, um, these little pieces that I've picked up here are for um, a little, um, not a little, but the advent calendars. So I, a few years ago, picked myself up one from Look Fantastic and they are really, really good. They are a bit pricey, but I treated myself to one a couple years ago and I honestly absolutely loved opening each day. And in each day there was like some sort of skincare or hair care or makeup and I really enjoyed that I love looking after my body and I love sort of skincare hair care and makeup um, and my children are at the age now where they're really starting to look after themselves and care about their appearance and I just felt like I wanted to make them one of these boxes so I looked online and I found them on Etsy which are great they're not as big as the look fantastic one but they're still quite a fair a fair a good size and you've got drawers for each day they're all different size drawers so you can put all different size gifts inside the drawers now I will be putting like a little chocolate in each day but I also will be putting things in that I know that they will either um need what they need or they will find useful or like 
either um, because I'm so sick of just buying things just for the sake of it. So I wanted to do something that I know that they are going to enjoy opening each day and also going to make use of each thing. So when I was in Home Bargains, I thought, right, I'm going to put some skincare in these um, boxes as well as stuff like PlayStation gift archer, uh, maybe a little piece of jewellery and some aftershave and stuff like that. So this is one of the items that I picked up for my nearly 17 year old. He has got a head full of hair and he's always asking me to grease his hair. Can you can you put some oil through my scalp? Um, and so because this has a spray on the top, I thought this is going to be so easy for him. It's not going to keep bothering me. And um, like I said, it's all natural um, oil. So a really good oil to use in your hair if you oil your scalp I feel like this will be a really good option and again it wasn't very expensive at all um next up for my younger son who is almost 14 I picked up this I've never used it before I've never seen it before but I thought that it looked quite good it's the L'Oreal um dream length curls and it's non-stop dreamy curls leave-in cream um so it says it moisturizes and defines by day um silk pillowcase effect by night so it's obviously going to make your hair feel really nice my younger son has not a lot of hair but he does have like some curls going on and so i thought that this would be a good little um present to put in one of the drawers and like i said the drawers are all different sizes so you can put all different things in so that one was for him and next up actually and staying in the hair care section um i see this it does look quite girly because it's got the pink top however i thought that it would be really useful for my older son he has got long hair he has got dreads and um you don't wash them as much as um you would normally wash your hair and so i thought that this would be really good it is a honey infused body and hair perfume and it smells really really nice um again it was you know really cheap and i just thought this would be great for him to sort of spray in his hair i would actually use this myself um so it was only a couple of pounds as well and they did have some other um hair care stuff with this but this one really sort of like i was like yep yeah, i'm gonna pick that up so i picked that up um then i also picked up this um high smile uh, which is a high smile um, red velvet toothpaste. Every time I go in super drugs with my son, he's always like, mum, can you buy that toothpaste? And I'm like, no, I'm not buying that toothpaste because I don't like the sound of it. And it is in super drugs about a tenner. Um, but in home bargains, it was a couple of quid. So I was like, right, great. I will pop that in his little box because he will really enjoy using this. He likes stuff like that. He's just, anything new anything different he wants to give a try so um i picked up that one for him and then for my older son to go in his box i picked up this um white glow uh white glow whitening toothpaste and my older son is so he's got the most beautiful with teeth they are so white and i'm always like i want my teeth to be just as white as yours and he's very into his self-care oral care and his yeah his teeth are immaculate so when i see this i thought he would really like this so i picked him up the uh white white glow i've never used it before but it looks really fancy it looks really nice and uh, i know that he'll definitely use it so that was gonna go in his one then i also picked up um this uh smoothing jelly cleanser as you can see here and i just really liked the packaging i'm talking quiet because my son's upstairs so i don't want him to hear um but i also picked this up because i thought that my younger son he's again getting into skincare getting into um you know trying out different cleansers and stuff like that and i'm always telling them use a cleanser to wash your face don't just use a bar of soap or use a shower gel um especially because my older son suffers with with acne um so from the time that he started getting acne i'm like you have to cleanse your face and use a proper cleanser so we all are into washing our face with cleansers and so i see this one and i thought the packaging's really nice and i thought that my 13 year old would really enjoy this so i picked that up for him so next i picked up this vitamin c 
um, brightening serum and it's got 3% active vitamin C, uh, brightens complexion, improves skin tone, fades dark spots. Um, and I picked this up for my older son just because I have used vitamin C for the last, I'd say six months. And I think it's made such a difference to my complexion, to my skin. Um, my face looks a lot more brighter. I don't have as, as many sort of dark, pop like dark spots or anything like that uh, and I definitely think it's down to using vitamin C so I picked up this because um I have mentioned to him about using vitamin C so when I see this I was like right we'll give it a go it looks quite it looks quite good um the packaging's uh really nice and yeah it's non-greasy it says non-sticky non-greasy lightweight uh form formula formula lation formulation uh so yeah um, it says on the back, formulated with 3% active vitamin C, a powerful an antioxidant to visibly brighten and fade dark spots within four weeks. This radiant boost boosting serum will improve an uneven skin tone and encourage a smoother, healthier complexion. So it sounds good and it says use morning and night, apply the serum by gently smoothing it over your face and neck. So I picked that up for him to go to go in his little um, advent um, calendar. And then next, I also picked him up one of these post-shaving balms. These are really good, these Nivea. Um, and again, the price of these were really, really good. It says instant hydration that protects after shaving. So the boys are getting a bit of bum fluff on their face and they are actually able to shave um so i wanted to just introduce them to you know the things that you need to use when you are turning into a man and looking after yourself and i thought i'd get them uh well get my older son this my younger son who is 13 going on 14 he has got a bit of a mustache now but he's not shaving his face however my older son is because he's got the uh, little goatee and it's just so weird to look at your kids and be like oh my god like they're growing into young men and they're actually like got facial hair and stuff like that and actually are taller than me now because I am a tall girl I am five foot ten and a half five foot eleven and both of them are taller than me now it is mind-blowing to yeah just see how much I've grown um so yeah, so this is uh, one of the items that I picked up for my older son's advent calendar. And I do love Nivea men. I think that Nivea cream in general is just lovely. Um, so yeah, I see this and I picked that up. And next, I also picked up this to go in one. Of, so some of the boxes are small. And so I thought that this would be perfect to go in one of the really small boxes. And it is a shaving oil and it's got menthol in it. It's for a cool, smooth shave every time and it's just like a little it's so small um but i just thought that this would go in one of the smaller drawers because there is like i think a couple of really small drawers so hopefully this will fit in it and again it was like 99p or something like that so yeah that is the next thing i picked up so the last couple of things in the skincare section was these spot zapper patches i have seen people using these but i don't know if they work but a lot of people say that they do um and as you guys know i have teenagers and they do get pimples and stuff like that so i thought that this would be another great little um either stocking filler just stick it in there or in the advent calendar if i can fit it in one of the drawers and again it was really really cheap and i know that there's one girl that i follow um she has acne and she gets sort of pimples quite a lot and she recommends these little um patches um so i just thought why not so i picked up that and then last i don't know if i'm going to keep this for myself or not but actually um i see these and i thought that they looked quite good they are under eye patches they're vitamin c again vitamin c is so good for your skin and the vitamin c that we get that we take in our body like if you um take vitamins in terms of the actual tablets or you put vitamins in your drink uh, vitamin c in your drink or something like that um it actually doesn't penetrate through the skin um so using vitamin c on your skin um in terms of like you know these little patches under your eyes or using a serum 
um, is really helpful. So just keep that in mind that when you are taking vitamin C, the oral ones, it doesn't actually penetrate through the skin. From what I'm aware of, that, that I've researched about vitamin C, you actually need to put it onto your skin. Um, so yeah, when I see these, I thought that these are great. And like I said, I've been using vitamin C for the past, say, six months. Um, it's quite new to me. Like I, I just started seeing a lot of people talking about it and how good it was for your skin. And honestly, I have really seen a difference since I've started actually putting it onto my skin as to, you know, um, having like a, like I've got the um, hydration tablets that have vitamin C in them. Um, and I drink drink vitamin C but I actually have seen such a big difference since actually using products on my skin so yeah when I see these I thought why not you know I used to have really dark circles under my eyes and there's still there's still slightly a little bit of sort of darkness under my eyes but nothing the way they used to be so yeah I may yeah, I may keep these for myself you never know but I do like sometimes just spending quality time with my boys and I, I like I'm not really into computer games. I really love skincare and stuff like that. So sometimes I'm like, let me give you a facial or let's sit down and do some face masks and have a chat. And so these are great to like get them involved or whatever. So um, yeah, I picked these up. I may keep them for myself. And like I said, they were just a couple of quid. So yeah, really, really like the look of these. But I see these when I was walking down sort of like the aisle where there's pants and a uh, few sort of clothing pieces and I really like the look of them and now I do have short hair I'm really leaning into wearing caps especially on a Sunday when it is um rugby day or um we are going to basketball because both my children they are high, heavily into their sports and so some days I I don't have time to sort of like get ready and do my hair and do whatever and I just feel like I'm really leaning into wearing caps so I see these and I just like the look of them this one is like a sort of a beige color like a stony beige color and it is like a sort of soft sort of material to touch and yeah this is a really nice neutral one I do have a few sort of neutral hoodies and stuff like that so I thought like this would definitely go with sort of my neutral hoodies and and uh, that type of uh, look if I want to go more of a neutral look and then I see that they also had it in this grey and I do have like a grey hoodie so I was like oh this would go with my grey hoodie again um, really nice uh, soft material like that brush soft material and they were three pounds each so not bad at all as you can see here it says three pounds um and yeah i only see these colors so i didn't see any other colors i did actually see a navy blue one but it wasn't like this kind of soft brush feel um so yes yeah, so i picked those two up for myself um and then i also picked myself up some turmeric and uh black pepper capsules um i take these ever since I was diagnosed with fibromyalgia, uh, someone recommended taking turmeric and said that like, it's really good for you. It does help with the body pains. And honestly, I, ever since I did start taking them, I do feel like I can feel a difference. Um, turmeric is really good for you. So if you can get that into your body, then I highly suggest it. And these capsules work wonders, like they do the job. They have 60 in them and you take one a day. So this is a five 500 milligrams one um and like i said they're really good for you even if you don't have chronic illness you know turmeric is really good for your body so yeah pick those up and i think they were a couple of quid as well which is great but moving on to homeware home stuff and cleaning stuff um, I picked up these large tea lights. I have a wax burner and every time I put a small candle it always um it always burns just part of the wax and not all of it i feel like because the wax um the candle's too small for that wax burner so uh, uh, about two weeks ago uh, or a bit longer i picked up the large ones from b and and they worked really well so when i went into home bargains and i see that they had this pack i thought i'll pick these up they last eight hours which is really really good and um i think you've got 12 in this bag i should have picked up two bags but i only picked up one um and they were a couple of quids if that so really really good the 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 weather's starting to get dark 
it's starting to get dark. Honestly, I'll be honest, I'm not really enjoying this sort of winter, autumn, winter. I was in, I do love autumn, but, and I don't, it doesn't really normally affect me when we have to like put the clocks back. But this year, it really has affected me. Like, I really, it's like giving me like, not depression, but I just feel like, I don't feel as happy as I do when it's brighter. I don't know if you guys understand what I'm what I mean by that, but because of the dark evenings, it's just really like put a dampener on my mood for some reason. But this is the first year that I've actually really felt it and um, and it's been really noticeable within myself. Like I just feel some type of way. But yeah, anyways, moving on to um sort of home cleaning stuff oh my god i have never smelt this before i've never actually even smelt the, i've never actually even seen this brand before and i see in the laundry detergent section they had these and honestly they all smell amazing and i really couldn't pick i really didn't need any more sort of laundry stuff but i could not leave this behind it smells so good, guys. So this one here is for colours, which we mainly do colours. We only do maybe like one whitewash a week um, and all the rest are colours because the kids are obviously, like I said, very sporty. Um, we've got one rug, like my younger one plays rugby. He also boxes and the older one plays basketball. So I have a lot of gym stuff. Plus they always go into the gym. So I have a lot of sports wear. And I do a lot of washing and I see this one and this one is in the fragrance Renew it's called and it says it cleans gently and re revitalizes colours um, plus renews fibres um, and you can put it on a cold wash if you want to but this actual one smells so nice. They had a darker uh, bottle which was like a, I don't know if it was a black bottle or a navy blue bottle and that one that one smelled really good as well and I really just had to pick between the two and it was this one so yeah really really like that one um I also picked up this Lenore Wellbeing Unwind Sandalwood and Eclipsus. um this smells really nice I've never bought this smell before um this scent it smells so good. It smells so fresh, so clean. So fresh as the clean. Um, but yeah, I've never bought this one before and it smells so, so good. I, I really did want to get into like maybe buying cleaning products for like the season, like the kind of autumnal ones. But honestly, I don't actually like the smell of them. Um, yeah, I don't actually like the smell of them. There's only a few things that I like the smell of that are kind of, because they're all kind of, what is the the um, scent of it? It's all like the red apple kind of, what is it called? I can't even remember. But it's like the cinnamony smell and I'm not really into that. I just like a clean, fresh smell. And these two um, items smell amazing. So they also do some Spanish um, cleaning stuff, which if you haven't tried, you need to try it. Try this floor cleaner. It is absolutely amazing. The pet one, uh, which is in like a, like a greeny, a greeny bottle that one also smells amazing but this week I picked up this one and like I said it smells so good like it smells so clean like when you clean your floors on this the house smells amazing so I picked up these and I think these were like two pound odd now where I live there's a stall on the weekends where she sells all the sm Spanish cleaning stuff and she sells it for like double the price so yeah if you um haven't tried this I would highly recommend trying the Spanish they've got Spanish liter like detergent to wash your clothes detergent not detergent what am I talking about I was about to say laundry and detergent together and it kind of like meshed in anyways um next up this is the one of the things that i did pick up that is kind of like seasonal and it's the winter spice um long lasting freshness toilet sort of cleaner this actually did smell quite nice i don't know if i can get it open there but when i sm smell it in store yeah this does have that kind of sort of 
I don't know, nutmeggy cinnamon smell, but it actually smells okay. So, and I love Astonish, like I love this brand. They're, they're all of their items, they are cheaper and initially you don't really get attracted to picking them up. You always get attracted to picking up, you know, like flash and stuff like that, which are like probably triple the price. Try Astonish. Honestly, I'm not kidding you. Their stuff is really nice and it's really affordable. So you don't really need to pay really expensive prices to get really nice cleaning stuff. Um, so yeah, give them a try. This is my ride or die. This stuff is bloody amazing. Honestly, I use this to clean the cooker. I'll use it to wipe the walls down if there's any sort of dirt marks on the walls. I will use this on a stain on the carpet. I'll use it on a stain on the on your clothes. This is amazing. If you have never tried this, honestly, where have you been? This stuff is honestly the best cleaning thing ever it is so multi sort of functional you can use it on so many different things and as you can see it says all purpose degreaser um and you can see here it shows you you can use it on fabrics you can use it on your cooker you can also use it on outside plastics i also use this on my windows like when i'm cleaning outside the window ledges it gets them sparkling white this is magic in a bottle so yeah really love it and it's like a pound so why not i also love the elbow grease glass cleaner this glass cleaner is by far my favorite it's the best and you can pick it up for as cheap as a pound some places i have been in one shop and he was selling it for 179 and i was like no um, i'm gonna go to savers or i'm gonna find it somewhere else in savers it's about one pound maybe one pound ten and i also found this in home bargains and it was like a pound it is really nice i've got a lot of glass in my house my light uh, my lampshades are glass balls i use it on those i use it on my mirrors i use it on my windows i use it on every bit of glass and it is amazing it smells really nice as well so I think that's one of the reasons why I like it and it leaves no streaks it's a really nice glass cleaner so I also came across this new Febreze and I've never seen it before this is like a seasonal uh, item cleaning item and it is in the scent sugar plum delight it actually smells so delightful um so yeah I would definitely recommend this if you do like a Febreze I like spraying these on like when I've made the bed up or on the sofa on my cushions on my curtains anywhere I do like to give a little bit of a Febreze spray so next I picked up this uh carpet refreshener and um I've never used this one before as you can see here I've never used it but I gave it a little sniff and it smells really nice. It smells absolutely lovely. So, and it was like a panned. And so I thought I'd pick that up. I just would pop this on my staircase um, and in the bedrooms. I just thought in the boys' bedroom, this really, honestly, boys, growing boys. Oh, they are gross. Take it from me, they're gross. Um, so this is another seasonal uh, item that I picked up. Again, like I said, I'm not really down with the seasonal uh, cleaning products, but this one smelled quite nice. It is the Active Fresh Winter Berry Burst infused with essential oils. And it does smell really, really nice. It smells really nice. It, just, it smells quite like fruity. Actually, I'm not really a fruity person, but in the bathroom, I don't really mind it. And like I said, um, it wasn't one that really um, smelled overly sort of sickening, if you know what I mean. Because I, I do find that sometimes the cleaning products that are sort of seasonal, especially sort of winter with the apple and the cinnamon, like it, it the smells kind of smell a bit sickly to me so I normally stay clear but that one does smell quite nice so I also found these designer fragrance um, air fresheners and this one is called only you and it, it's a blast a blast can air freshener and honestly guys this smells so nice look how it comes out as well comes out like that it smells so good. It smells like perfume. It smells so good. And it was like one pound or 
you know, if that, just the over panned, but it smells so nice. And they had some other, um, they had some other flavours or other scents, shall I say, they're not flavours, flavours is what you eat. Um, they had other scents, but this was my favourite. Next up, we have this Febreze plug-in and it is in the scent Nautic Sky. And they had this uh, spray, the uh, air freshener, and I smelt the air freshener. It smelt really, really nice. So I thought I would pick one of these up. I, I should have picked two up. I don't know why I picked one up, but I picked this one up and it smells really nice. So is this, oh no, this is not the same. I was about to say, is it the same? This is um, Sugar Plum Delight and this is Nautic Sky. Um, I didn't pick up any Christmas decorations and the reason why I didn't pick up any Christmas decorations just yet is because I want to pull out my Christmas decorations and see what I have and what I don't have and see what I want to replace and what I don't want to replace. I don't want to just buy stuff for the sake of it so I haven't bought any Christmas decorations just yet and that will probably be next week I'll probably go to home bargains and really get stuck in with the Christmas decorations however I did pick up this little bag well not little it's quite big it's a tree storage bag and the reason why I picked this up because I know that last year my tree storage bag I think it the um side of it ripped but I just kind of thought it's okay it'll make do and so when I see this it was like one pound or one pound 99 it, it was less than two pounds I thought you know what I'm gonna take that home with me it's really sort of it's that um you know that material what do they call it T towel pulling I don't know what it's called um but it's really robust and feels nice and thick so for two pounds you can't go wrong really so I picked that up and that was the only thing that I picked up in the um Christmas decoration section just like I said it um I didn't want to buy things unnecessarily. Last couple of products at the bottom of the bag. My lash is getting in my eye. Um, I picked up these overall pads. I use these every now and then. If I can't find any of my reusable ones, I will use one of these. And I particularly like the shape of these. I feel like you can get all over your face with these. My son also uses them. So yeah, I just thought I would um, get a few more of those. I only picked one pack up because I think we do have a couple upstairs. And I also picked up this body souffle um, cocoa, coconut oil, infused with coconut oil. Honestly, this smells really, really nice. And like I said, I'm so into my skincare and creams and stuff like that. And this was a couple of quid and it is got a really, really nice texture. I'll show you what it looks like. It is like a souffle as well, which is kind of like a bit souffle -y. Um, But yeah, it smells amazing. So I picked that up and like I said, it was only like a couple of quid. Um, I picked that up for myself. And last two, three bits are this little um, hand nail cleaner. We don't have one of these. We used to have one and I don't know where it went and I see this and it was like 39p so I was like that's going to go upstairs. Like I said my son plays rugby and it is getting to the point where the ground is a lot more dirty like it's a lot more moist so he's getting a lot more mud in his fingers and so I thought this would be really useful to have upstairs when he comes back from rugby. Um, I also picked up a new wooden stick. I only went down one of the kitchen aisles and I um, thank God that I did because there was so much nice pieces, especially by this man here, Tom Kitchens. And the last two things which are the same are two little glasses. They're not that little, they're quite weighty and I love that. I love drinking my cup of tea out of a glass mug. I've got a thing about it. I don't know what it is, but I just love drinking my tea out of a glass mug. And I see these and they are not flimsy at all. They're quite like, they're not too heavy, but they're quite heavy. Um, they're lovely and thick. They're not like the real thin um, glass. And so I just picked up two. Maybe when I go back into store, I'll pick up um, maybe another two. I do have some glass mugs already, but they are sort of, they're quite old and they're on their way out so I might just replace them with these ones. I just love looking at a nice cup of tea in a nice glass mug. I don't know what it is guys. If you're with me, 
comment down below and let me know if you like drinking your tea out of a, a glass mug but anyways that has been my home bargains uh haul i hope you enjoyed it it was just like a little sit down and show you what i got and um yeah like i said there wasn't any christmas bits in this haul but i will be going back into store to get some christmas decorations however i want to pull out what i have at home have a look see what i want to replace see what i want to keep and then i can be more mindful when I go into the store as to going absolutely crazy and wanting everything in store because they have such amazing um, Christmas decorations. If you are looking to re revamp your Christmas kit with all the decorations or you want to change the colour, look in Home Bargains before you look anywhere else because they have really nice stuff and for really good prices. Like, you'll be so surprised. Um, but yeah, that has been my Home Bargains haul. Thank you for spending time with me today. It's been really nice to sit down and talk with you. And I really look forward to seeing you all in my next video. Wherever you are in the world, whatever you're doing, take real good care of yourself and I'll be seeing you very, very soon. God bless, guys. Bye.